Okay, so for now, I'm going to keep my lights on so I know what I'm doing here. So now we passed the very first test, okay? So now let's just go ahead and connect on photo. If you're going to do astrophotography, that's where you start. Everybody starts in the photo mode, okay? So now here we are, our first look of the app. And let's just go ahead and get a little bit familiar here with some of the functions. So right here on the uh, top, it's the uh, photo album. And that's where all of the photos are going to store there. Uh, the uh, photo icon here, that's a very important one. As you press that one, you click on that one and it shows all the other features for photography during the day. But the one that we want to work on is the astro mode, which is the one that it's going to be for astrophotography. All of the other settings here, you don't need to touch them. You don't need to do anything. Those are, if you want to do photography during the day, that's the ones that you're going to use and it's going to be pretty much like a regular camera. But what we're going to work with is astro photo. The next icon here, the focus is very important and we have three modes we have the auto we have the plus and the minus and this is where we need to start working a little bit uh, get familiar to do the settings as quick as possible when you start your imaging sessions and you don't miss anything you want to be sure that you're familiar with it and we have object sun track moon track when you touch that little square then when you go to the next one this one right here that's the one for the shutter gain and infrared filter we're going to go more into details when I do the live demonstration outside another one that it's very important and has all kind of improvements now it's the uh, joystick okay and the joystick now also has <laughs> a new feature it's going to have multiple speeds you can also uh, touch this button here and it's the one that it's going to turn on that green joystick or off. The big screen here, it's going to be for telephoto or wide angle. Like right now, you, we don't see anything because we're in here in the house, but uh, this is the uh, telephoto. And then you touch again on the square and then you go into the wide angle, which is the way you're always going to start your astrophotography night. We can also turn it off, the screen right there, touching that green button. And the X is to go back to the main menu where you connected. If you have any problems with the telescope, and uh, it freezes or whatever is happening that it's not working you want to go back here to the x and press here touch it and it will take you back to the main page which is going to be the one that says connect and photo and if you have to restart the telescope that's where you're going to do